Grand Rising Collectives, and welcome back for another Love Timber Love Reading. Shout out to the beautiful, amazing people of the world. I hope this video finds you guys doing absolutely amazing and abundant. Uh, keep in mind that this is a general love reading. It is a love reading, and whatever else comes out, but I'm focusing on love because I am love. I am a Scorpio. Speaking of, it is still officially Scorpio season, and although we may have a couple of days left in Scorpio season, if you know, you know about Scorpios because, honey, Scorpios are forever, all right? They like, they just like diamonds. <laughs> so happy birthday to the beautiful, amazing Scorpios, all right? But this is a general collective reading for every zodiac sign. It doesn't matter if you are masculine or a feminine, if this resonates with you. Please like, share, and subscribe to this channel, all right? So pulling from the realest oracle here, you got blissed, blissed out. It's almost like having an amazing time here. You may be invited to gatherings or a holiday fun. It's like this is a festive time here. It says blissed out. See somebody on stage here, see? See somebody crunk here. Somebody litty, litty, lit, lit, okay? I'm talking about they are on one. It could also represent that you are getting a lot of attention, a lot of um, accomplishments, a lot of the slime light could be on you. You could be blissed out. You, your, your energy could be in such a beautiful way that it is attracting people and is bringing the light to you. Or you are the light that's promoting other people. So you got blissed out. Number 19, which is the number 20. Something could happen on the 20th of this month, November. Something could even be about to happen on the 20th of December. So this is your message for... Wait a minute, is that it? That's 19. Blissed out. It's fire and earth. Listen, collective. It says fulfillment, happiness, europhia. Uh, take time to show gratitude for all the good. This card means place, success, and joy. Define this time or event. Chase experiences that feel electric. You may find yourself in awe of what is possible as life's greatest gifts are illuminated here. See? See there? Spirit say, look, you got some good energy collective. Blissed out. Going out and having yourself a good time. Uh, you know, living in the moment, allowing yourself to be carefree, allowing yourself to be like that kid, you know, where you're uh, absolutely amazed and optimistic. You know, it seems like somebody got some good energy and you're starting it off with the Knight of Cups. So spirit could be, oh, you, you may be attracting all types of folks, the Knight of Cups, the Knight of Wands, oh, the Fool, see, Look at that. So you got two nights. You got a fire sign, a water sign. Or this could be you passionate about love and life. Living your life. You may be doing uh, adventurous things. You may be um, kayaking. <laughs> Somebody may be kayaking, okay? You may be kayaking. But I feel like this blissed out is bringing a lot of jealousy too. See, somebody's jealous here. They, but they go to Seven of Swords. And there go the lovers. See? And there go the king of swords. And look, there go just this. Libra energy. And I feel like who you are, you could be the queen of pentacles with options here. See? So things that have been hidden from you, collective, are about to be re revealed with this moon in the reverse. See? Because things are turning around here. See? See? So for some of you guys, you may have been in some type of stalemate energy in your love life and all types of things, but this will of fortune is letting you know that things does not always stay the same, whether they are good or not so good. It's just the karmic cycle, the will of life. We all experience it. You remember in the, you remember where it says that the creator reigns on the just and the unjust alike. So this, this does not matter, your financial status, your, your accolades, your success, or even the lack thereof, everything changes here, okay, with that will of fortune. So if things have not been so good with the will of fortune and the upright, it is your time for things to turn around in your favor. So if there's been some things that have been hidden from you, this will of fortune is going to reveal a lot of things for you. It's also going to bring in uh, justice, uh, restore balance here. 
I feel like someone is checking you out and they're curious about what are you doing. I feel like somebody feels like you have options here, okay? Somebody here could be worried that you're, you're, you may be interested because especially if you got the limelight on you, you know, you're very, very successful. You're grounding yourself. You're coming off here as someone here who is a kept person or someone here is good marriage material. Someone, you, look, you may have many options trying to figure out, are they going to be the lucky one here? But remember, even in all these options, you still have to use your intuition because you don't always know what you're getting to after you get it. So, but with this, you could be a Libra, you could be an Aries. Libra, Gemini, you got Gemini, you got Gemini, Libra, and Aries. Those are your major arcanas. And then you got the Knight of Cups, the Seven of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, the Knight of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, the Seven of Swords, Justice, the Lovers, the King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius here, all right? So, somebody may see you blissed out and they're feeling some type of way. It could be somebody here holding back their feelings, not letting you know how they feel about you with the Seven of Swords and the Lovers here. And it could also be somebody here who is jealous here because maybe you're keeping your options open. Maybe you're out here living your life. Maybe you're out here dating. Maybe this is your birthday season and you know you're just being the life of the party. Maybe you're posting pictures and everybody is seeing them and they got some, they got a problem <laughs> with it. I feel like somebody here is jealous here, okay? So let's see. Let's start off with the Seven of Swords. Why is the Seven of Swords here for the collective in Blissed Out? What is the message for the collective in love with the Seven of Swords with Blissed Out? What is this about? Could also represent a lot of people would love to date you. A lot of people would love to be, you could be on the front street, you could be getting a lot of attention, you could be on social media, and they're one of your fans, and, and you don't know it, why is the Seven of Swords here? See, and there's the Hermit, somebody's trying to figure out something. Somebody may feel like you're hiding something, could be a Virgo. Like, I feel like, see, someone is, see, and I feel like you're the Empress, the fool in the reverse, the ten of pentacles here. Somebody may be looking at you to find out if you are married or not too here. So someone may want to reach out to you. So somebody is coming off as a kept person here who was taken care of with this empress. But they're, but they're not optimistic here. Someone don't want to take a chance because somebody feels like, look, I feel like somebody wants to. I feel like somebody's mind is racing. Because they're trying to find out something. And it could be somebody who, who is heavily in their feelings here. Because there go the Ten of Pentacles. So once again, this could be an old spouse of yours or someone looking at you like they sure want to rush into you. But they don't want to take the risk because they may be looking at you like, I know you got somebody. Because you're coming off as somebody here who, you know, the Empress, the Ten of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, you're coming off as somebody here who could possibly be married here. So I feel like although you got people, you got the limelight on you, you got folks looking at you, but I feel like people's trying to figure out what, what your status is. So what's up with the lovers for the collective? Why is the lovers here? Could be a Gemini. Clarify the lovers. See, there's the chariot. So this could be someone from your, this is somebody here who wants to succeed. This is somebody here who wants to be, I feel like somebody want to be your lover. But, they, but they're trying to figure out, do you have another lover? Here's what I feel like. Could be a cancer. <laughs> so I feel like this is somebody you, you've, uh, you're you in separation with. They're dreaming. See, somebody dreaming. Oh, my gosh. See? <sighs> I feel like someone is having certain type of dreams, okay? Especially if this is someone from your past. But they don't have the courage to come back because I feel like somebody's afraid of your answer. I feel like somebody wants to know what you are doing without you telling them. Because somebody don't want to take a risk. And I'm telling you, they want you. But they don't want to be rejected either. I feel like somebody got a lot of pride and ego. See? And there go the page of cups. See? And there go the ace of pentacles here. See? And there they are again. There go the king of wands. And there go the two of cups, see? I feel like somebody don't want you to be with somebody else. But you guys could be in separation here. Because maybe this person was not, you know, offering much. 
Maybe this person was taking their time. So let's see about this Queen of Pentacles. Like I say, it's a soulmate. Someone here that I feel like you're not talking to or somebody, somebody wants to know your secret here. That's what it is. Somebody wants to know what you hiding. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Somebody trying to figure out what you got going on. What is your secret? Because they want to know. And I feel like somebody, I feel like somebody think it's dealing with, uh, see, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, see, and there go that King of Swords, see? So this person is, this person is in their head. They're not coming up with the right conclusion. I feel like their mind is playing tricks on them because you're coming off as somebody here who is very, very independent, very beautiful, very confident, very alluring. You're getting a lot of attention on you. And somebody's trying to figure out, what are you doing? Who are you doing it with? See, eight of wands, they want to know. And there's the three of pentacles. So someone could see you, somebody could feel like you've moved on and they want to know for sure because they miss you, honey. Mm-hmm. And, like, I feel like they're jealous, too. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here with this Queen of Wands? Got the Empress, see? <laughs> Ace of Wands, I told you. Somebody want to know. And there go that freaking King of Swords again, see? But they're not clear. But I feel like this person is not communicating this with you, okay? It's like this person's not communicating this with you, see? The Eight of Wands in the reverse and the Two of Pentacles. And there go the Devil. See, this person has lost it, y'all. This somebody could be a Scorpio, could be a Capricorn. I feel like this is something that you walked away from, okay? You may have had to find yourself, and now that you're back on top, now you're blissing out, now, now you're living your life, and people are noticing it, especially people from your past, and they're losing it, okay? With that Two of Pentacles in the reverse, because it's over, and they're in their feelings, see? Oof. Why is this King of Swords here for the collective? Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. You got Capricorn. Why is this King of Swords here? See? The Knight of Swords in the reverse because somebody wants to get down to the truth. Somebody wants to speak their truth, but they're not clear about what is going on. See? See, they're watching you, but, but they're getting... I feel like this person is getting mixed signals. They, they're not understanding what they're seeing, Okay? Or what they're hearing. Somebody, like I said, somebody could be watching your see. They not sure, see? <laughs> they go the nine of pentacles in the reverse. They want you, but they ain't finna get their feelings hurt, see? See, they do not want to get their feelings hurt, see? There they go again, a seven of swords, see? They in, somebody, somebody is losing it, all right? They are totally falling apart. Because here they is wanting to come in and do their thizzle with the Knight of Wands in the reverse, but they don't know what you got going on. And I did somebody from your past, all right? It's like they missing you, okay? They're really, really missing you on all levels, especially that other level, all right? But somebody is afraid of getting, somebody's afraid of, it's like they want to find out behind the scenes what's going on in your life. So like I say, y'all can very, very well be posting a lot of going out pictures. See, somebody see you living your life. Somebody looking at you online. Either you looking good. You you, you telling folks you dating. And somebody's get, gathering information here by what they're seeing. But they're not sure if that is what it is. Because they're not being honest with themselves, okay? Because they want to get with you, all right? But they don't want to put their work in and get, get their feelings hurt, all right? So why is the Seven of Cups here? I feel like somebody feels like they don't want to be an option, okay? This could have been somebody here who you was dealing with in the past that was not open with you. See, Seven of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, see? See, and there it is, the Three of Cups, I told you. <laughs> see, and they go to Five of Swords, they in their head. It's like somebody here, like, like if this was somebody you were dealing with in the past and they were not really open with you, you know what I'm saying? You know, they could have been, somebody could have been open. Somebody could have just didn't have no 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 bars hold. They could have spoke their truth where, where it was hurtful. You know what I'm saying? It was very, it seemed like somebody just wanted to leave you, you know, have a good time with you. But they wasn't offering anything, okay? Anything stable. Now, I feel like now that you're not around this person here, this person has been watching you. And, and, and when you walked away from this person, they did not like that. But I feel like you got tired of one side of relationships. And now that I feel like you picked yourself up, 
and you've moved on confidently. You could even be dating other people. For some of y'all, you could very well be in another relationship. Now they're losing it. <laughs> because they want you back, but they don't want to be no option. Maybe, maybe they had you an option. See, the magician card. See, if somebody feeling like they don't have the power no more, somebody, see, like I tell you, they done lost this, see? They have lost their power and they have lost, they, they've lost their confidence because I feel like somebody, I feel like somebody is like this. They don't want to ask you. They don't want you to tell them. They want to find out on their own because they don't want you to know how they feel. They don't want you to know that they're watching you from a distance. They don't know. They don't want you to know just how much it affected them when you had to walk away from their toxic sales. All right. This person could have been generous. This person could have just been indecisive. But when I tell you, they done lost it. So what they have been doing is keeping tabs on you or asking around. Somebody may be telling this person that they see you out here dating somebody else. You could have a mutual mutual friends here. But but their problem is, is that if they was to find out for sure that not only are you dating other people, but you're intimate other, with other people, that's going to crush them. Because... Like, like, I feel like for some of y'all, if y'all were just trying to build with this person and you didn't want nobody else but them, but they didn't make you a priority, they don't, they're jealous. I just feel like somebody is jealous and this, this will break them. Because I feel like somebody is trying to figure out who are you giving your time and energy to because you're not giving it to them and that's what's bothering them. So why is it like, it's like this person, they want you, but it's like before I make a fool out of myself. I need to know for sure. They say, I do it. I don't have no problem trying to get them back because I miss them. But what would do my what would be my undoing is if I had to find out that they have already <laughs> crossed that line. <laughs> this will be the point of no return for them, I feel like. So why is the Knight of Cups here? Yeah, y'all, somebody done, somebody done lost it, okay? They done totally broke down because they don't know what you're doing. Knight of Cups, see? And Knight of Wands in reverse. I feel like this, if someone thinks that you're giving your love somewhere else, this has totally kicked them in their ego here. Because maybe somebody thought that they was your best with the Knight of Wands because you got the Knight of Wands here twice. I feel like, see, now they feeling left out. I told you, see? If they think you're giving that cup of your love to somebody else, they're in their feelings because they want you back. But that's, pro see? Ten of Swords, see? So this person has been watching you from a distance once again. Two of, two of Wands, but they don't know what they're seeing here. They're, 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 they're confused. It's like, it's like they're in... De I feel like someone is in denial. Like I said, somebody probably thought that they, they, they did something amazing with you. That Knight of Wands energy. And they can't even... It's like... They can't even see you with nobody else. So if you were with somebody else, they don't believe it. <laughs> or at least they're hoping it's not true because they got plans for you. They was trying to come back around in the Knight of Wands. But if they think you got somebody else, they're going to become the Knight of Wands in the reverse. I'm telling you. If this could be their karma, why is the Knight of Wands here? You got the will of fortune. What goes around comes back around. If you was trying to love somebody and the only thing they want to do was come in here and just see Knight of Cups. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh-uh. Nine of Cups. Six of Swords. And Justice in the reverse. So they are guilty. They know they're guilty. This is why it's messing up their head. Now look at them. Because they didn't want no relationship. They just wanted to come in here and have a good time. All right? So they're getting karma. Because they're afraid that you're holding back or they're getting karma because they was holding back. Now they're worried that whatever whatever you gave to them that they took for granted, they're worried that you're giving it to somebody else. This is their karma, y'all, because they're the justice is again in the reverse. Now, I feel like somebody may want to make it right, but that's why you this is why you left them alone to begin with because they were selfish. There, there it is, see? We clarified the night of one. Ain't this a selfish energy? Exactly. So now y'all doing y'all own thing and y'all don't need this person. Y'all living y'all life. Now they done fell apart <laughs> because they know all that good stuff you did for them. They pushed you away because they was uh, they was being deceptive. They, was, they, they wasn't being honorable. They didn't have no integrity. And now somebody's afraid that maybe you, maybe you want something new and you don't want them no more. Why is the fool here? See, y'all, I'm telling you. 
all these arrogant player energies where these bosses were. And I ain't saying you can't have all your people. You could do things your, your way, but when you bring heartache and pain to other people, it's going to come back on you. And it's like when everybody feel like they within their power in the relationship and they listen to their ego because you got a real person that's invested into you, really in love with you, really trying to show you. Instead of appreciating them, they start letting it go to their head. So spirit is humbling these prideful men, men or women, who think that just because they got a lot of money, and but but they're selfish, like they want you to do them, give them everything, because you got the night. Look, this is how good you get gave to them. The Knight of Wands with the Nine of Cups. That's what you gave to them. But what were they offering? Nothing. They thought that they was too good. See, that's them. King of Pentacles, they was holding back here. See? For some of y'all, this person's receiving karma. Spirit's letting you know you may have moved away from this person or this person was trying to move away from you because you wouldn't give in to what they wanted and that's their karma. <clears throat> they getting karma, I'm telling you. And their karma is that they're losing it, all right? <clears throat> Especially if they think that, that, they, that, that they no longer can get the benefits that you used to give them because they took it for granted and because they need to be humble. So why is the fool here? See, this is real. So you may be in a blissful time, god dang it, and it's, it's breaking them down. I'm telling you, it's break, breaking them down. Now, if you, if you done got your bliss back after all of the games... They know it. They see it, and it, they're panicking. I'm telling you, they have lost it. They can no longer keep control of this. No, they have lost it. They are falling apart. See, look. Now they go to food. Now y'all make. Now this, this person could be looking at you like you done went and found you a real one. All right, because you got the empress here. See, they go to freaking sun. See, could be an Aries or a Leo. See. But for some of y'all, this person here, they're receiving karma here. Yeah, everything has went bad because you got the will of fortune in the reverse. So once again, this haughty emperor, somebody was trying to act. Somebody did not use their wisdom. Somebody did not use their morals and integrity. They mishandled it. So it's almost like they're forced to deal with this karma here because they was not a team player. They were selfish. They did not want to cooperate. See, and not only that, they have not learned their lesson here. The teacher in the reverse, but you got the will of fortune. So yeah, for some of y'all, the person here who did you wrong, they have not learned their lesson here. They're still prideful. They're still trying to act like it's a problem. And I'm going to tell you what they're going through. They've lost it. And they thought that they was on cloud nine because they was doing you wrong. But when the universe steps in, oh baby, they they, they not going to bounce back. They got to they gotta feel this. So they could be experiencing a financial loss. And I feel like it's it's the unalive of the pride, all right? It's the unaliving of the pride, okay? That's what's happening. And people are going to realize that everything you do comes back on you, all right? So if you hustling somebody, you think you're getting away with it, see, there it is again. Steady showing up. There is justice and there is the six of pentacles in the reverse, see? So they're receiving karma collective, see, for all of the games that they play. And then for some of y'all, this person can't handle it. This person can't handle it. Scorp I mean, I'm saying Scorpio is not Scorpio, but you could be a Scorpio. Because look, you got the five of souls. Look how they play games. See? So you ultimately, you walked away from this person and left them to deal with their karma because that's exactly what they're living with. See? There's the five of wands here. See? And they're in, in a conflict. Like, I feel like this person going through it. So if you walked away from this karmic, if you got off of this toxic wheel cycle, then you're 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 the one exp experiencing the bliss. Okay, you're getting a lot of attention. You're gonna be have a lot of success. There's a lot of abundance around you. But whoever it was who thought that they could uh, uh, exalt themselves over a gift, because that's what you were, the gift. But they don't want to look at it like that. Look what they did. They didn't want that. But this is what came with you, the Ten of Pentacles. They didn't want this. They don't want to take no risk on this, which is what they should have. So as a result, because of all of the games that they played, running away from this connection, because it's almost like this. 
Instead of you playing games, just don't deal with this person because you can't give them what they want. Don't take from them. And that's what they did. They're guilty and they're receiving karma. And your blessing and your karma is that you're on top of the world and you're getting all this recognition and attention. It's like the roles have been reversed. The will of fortune has came and reversed the roles. So it is backfired. Once again, what goes around, come around and somebody can't handle it. But you're going to be on cloud nine. See, because you got it. The ancestors got you exactly where you need to be front stage and center here or in a beautiful place here. So whatever they did, they didn't take you out. They didn't break you. They just pushed you where you ultimately supposed to be. Cause you know how sometimes you can you sacrifice for folks. Yeah. For some of y'all, 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 you probably was hoping this person did right by you. But for some of y'all, the only way they going to humble themselves is if when they get hit by the universe you know, sometimes they be so busy feeling themselves and, you know, on their own junk that they think they are untouchable. But like I say, you got the justice card here again in the reverse. There it is. See what they going through? See? They going through this, see? And there it is, see? So this is a bad, this is a bad time for your enemies and a beautiful time for you, all right? That's your, that's your reading. That's your message in this blissful energy. Bless, it said blissed out. Please like, share, and subscribe.